Hey guys, so I have a video for you today. This is going to be a haul slash try on in the dressing room because I did go to some of these stores and do a try on in the dressing room and I figured I would just combine the two because why do a haul on something you've seen me try on in the dressing room so you can see what I bought and then you can see me try it on. How about that? So I went to Rainbow. I did not get anything at Rainbow, but you will see the try on. Um, but I did buy some stuff from Charlotte Ruse, and I also did a quick outfit. This is featured on my Instagram as my outfit of the week. Um, you'll see that over there if you want to see. I'm going to do these like like one minute videos um, on Instagram, like just showcasing an outfit that I find a good deal on. So be sure to check over on my Instagram for that. But um, so Charlotte Ruse was having a sale on everything pretty much. And what I love about Charlotte Ruse is that they include plus sizes in their sales. There is no excludes plus sizes and this straight size is on sale and the jeans are on sale but the plus sizes in it, it's usually always included. And the Charlotte Ruse that I go to, shout out to them, amazing, amazing employees. But anyway, so, oh and I bought one thing from Target which I'll show you. Um, I do like these quick polls when I'm like out shopping and I'm like, quick, tell me which one to buy. Should I get this? Should I get that? And a lot of people are like, yes, no. And I'm like, you know, I based on things like that. Um, and everybody was like, no, they're ugly. And I was like in love with these sandals. They were rose gold, <sighs> comfy as hell. And everybody's like, no, what is that? And I'm like, it's rose gold. There's no question as to what it is. Like, come on, people. Anyways, but I didn't get them because they were $22, and I ended up putting that $22 towards, like, a lot of stuff at Charlotte Rose, which I'm happy I did. So the first thing, I'll just show you the Target thing. I mean, if you've seen me do my try-ons and stuff like that, I have these shoes in black, like a suede black and a suede uh, camel color, like a, you know. They had them in this nude color with little cuts cutouts these are the most comfiest flats ever and they have the little ties and they were seven dollars guys seven dollars normally 25 originally but um they're the massima brand and i'm in a size nine so at charlotte ruse they had a sale on jeans all jeans were 25 dollars. all shorts were 20 all uh, graphic tees and body suits were 15 so i was gonna get a pair of shorts but i'm like no because listen let's be honest as much as i want to like be body positive and sun's out buns out you know I do own a couple pairs of shorts and that's enough I'm not gonna keep investing in shorts when I am barely comfortable wearing shorts and the reason I'm not comfortable 100% wearing shorts I'm comfortable in most things but it's because of my knees I hate my knees there's always that one part you're like get it off of me I hate it and it's not me not embracing it I have inverted like inverted um if you've ever seen any pictures of me and all my my toes are usually cross like my feet are usually cross it's because my knees are inverted and um because of that any excess weight because i am overweight like settles in the it's just it's just i don't know it's like let's get into like body issues i love the refugee uh, shorts so if you do want to wear shorts and you want like those distressed frayed ones or even just regular ones the refuge brand is just like the best anyway so let's get into what i got so i ended up purchasing this this was on sale on their clearance rack and i did get it in a 3x i don't know that they had it in a smaller size um but I liked it in a 3X um, because it's oversized. So it has that crisscross, it's that blushy, um, dusty rose color, and it was $4.99. And did I tell you that I had it, and it's like that really soft material. You'll see it on the try-on, it's like one of my favorite things. Um, and then I bought a graphic tee uh, cut off. Um, last year I got one from Walmart that I wore the heck out of. It was a Leonard Skinner uh, cutoff. It was men's. And they didn't bring those back this year, which I'm so devastated because I would have bought, like, everyone. It's like the muscle tank, and you could wear it with bralettes or bandeaus. And it, I just wore the heck out of it last year. So I was like, oh, man, they don't have them this year. So this is what happens. I ramble. I ramble, ramble. That's why I do try-ons in the dressing room because I don't talk. Um, but I got this one, and it says rock... I think it says rock and roll okay i was looking for the and and the and is like in the middle of the shirt that's why i was confused it does say rock and roll it is that open crisscross thing um it's like super slouchy and comfy and it's that awesome material um the thing here is not adjustable but it's cute and it's uh, you'll see in the try on um you could definitely wear it with a regular bra if you want and you can wear it with a bralette um it's not too open and this was in a 2x and normally it was 21.99 but it was 15 and 15 is still a lot of money for me let me tell you but i've been looking for one of these that fits me well and i'm gonna wear the heck out of it in summer plus i had a coupon so it wasn't really 15 it was cheaper but we'll get into that 
Um, and the last two things I got were these jeans. These are the Refuge Plus Be Amazing Skinny Boyfriend. And I got them in an 18. Um, I don't own any of this color. Like this uh, white washed, um, light washed jeans. And these were $9. Hello, $9. They fit super comfy. They hold everything in. I was like, let me, because they didn't have these in my size on the rack of the sale or any of my size really. I'm a 20 at um, Charlotte Russe and in this brand, I'm a 20. Not every brand at Charlotte Russe. Um, they didn't have any 20s. They had 24s, 22s, and then like 16s. And I'm like, let me just try an 18. Let me just try it. And because there's so much stretch to these, oh, I love these jeans. You'll see them on the try on. And the last pair, I did a little poll. <laughs> I was like, hurry up quick, which ones, which ones? I wanted them all, but I cannot spend. I could not spend $50 in jeans because let me tell you, I just did a declutter and oh, I have so many jeans. It's disgusting. And here I am buying two more pairs, but these were normally 40 on sale for 25 with the coupon. I got them for like 60. I don't even know. It was cheap. And these are a dark washed, um, skinny boyfriend jean and they have that awesome stretch. They have the distressing, which I love. And then the bottoms are like this, which, oh my gosh, I love them so much. Um, I like this little detail. Normally I'm like, what the heck is this? And why is it like that? But it looks really nice once it falls. Kind of goes on the back of your ankle. And this is like the faux skinny ankle. So I really like them. And the item of the week on my Instagram was this jumpsuit from Old Navy. And like I've you've seen me try it on several times in those try-ons I've had tried on the black one I've tried on this one um the extra extra large is too big and it's not adjustable um well I mean it's technically adjustable they have like two buttons and you could adjust but like a half a centimeter I don't know um so I did get the extra large and it fits good I would have to wear like a little bit of a tummy sucking undies if I felt more comfortable but I mean it fits nice but you'll see it on my Instagram so be sure to go over to my Instagram to see that on the so here I am in Charlotte Rose. This was really cute, and um, but they only had it in a 1X. It was in the clearance. It did not button underneath. Um, I, I don't know where I would wear it, but I felt like trying it on. Um, if it was probably in a 2X, it would fit. The outer part was really big. Um, it was just the bodysuit that did not fit. Um, these jeans were in a size 22, um, too big, and the knee part didn't fall where it's supposed to. It should fall on my actual kneecap, but because I'm so short, things don't work like that for me half the time. Um, distressing always falls on weird spots, um, so they did fit really nicely, um, but as you can see, it would have just been better if it was a little bit tighter in the knee and leg part. These were in a size 20. Um, I think they fit a lot better. Um, these were really cute. All their jeans were on sale. Um, I wanted them all. Refuge jeans like fit me so well. Um, the bottom was a little bit different than um, usual, my usual kind of jean, and um, I wasn't sure that I liked it. I didn't. It looks okay on film, but in person, I was just like, mm -mm, it's a little odd. I do own a pair of their shorts. Um, these were in a size 24. These were big on me, but they were comfortable. I, these type of jeans from Refuge, you can wear them in a few different sizes and they fit differently, but they all still fit. Um, they were comfortable. They had a lot of these graphic, distressed, um, cutout tees, and they were all on sale. Um, this one was really cute, but it was a little bit short for my taste, but um, I did like the cutout. This next one was really cute. Um, I have these jeans that I'm wearing, uh, shorts that I'm wearing here, but in a darker wash. You've seen me try them on before, and these were in a 22. So as you can see, it's the same type of jean, but still has, they have a lot of stretch. They're probably one of my favorite brands. Um, the shirt was really cute. I liked the little cutout. I liked the, the roses. They had a lot of these. Um, and this is, this is an odd odd cut short I don't understand what they were trying to do it looked like somebody came in and took a bite out of my shorts um and these fit a lot differently which is odd but they were still the refuge brand um these are this different brand that I've never heard of Miss Ollie I believe and this was their biggest size and no 
they did not work as you can see the leg part was okay but then everything up was just like not happening no this was technically a dress but um I thought I would wear it either way. Leggings, I'd pull it up to wear it as a shirt. Um, it was super comfortable. It was on sale for $4. This was really pretty. It was like a tie-dye type of effect with a faux uh, choker cutout. It was really comfortable. I like where it hit. It was nice. This is the first thing from Rainbow. I think it was in a 2X, but it is definitely oversized. It was like a throw-on dress. Um, it was very cheaply made, though. I kind of ripped it a little bit, but... Anyways, this is the next item. It was really cute. Um, this was definitely better made. It was really pretty. I love the tropical colors. This was in a 2X. Um, I didn't feel like taking my jeans off. Sorry, guys. This was really cute, but it was $15, and I didn't think it was worth the price. Um, it was just a distressed tee. Um, comfy, but not worth $15. This was on the clearance rack. I did like the open back, but I just... I don't know. It was like two different kinds of shirts in one and it was a little bit too much going on um and it was only five bucks but i did not purchase it um it didn't really fit that well the fire fox i think is the brand it's just runs small or on fire whatever the brand is it just runs a little bit small this next shirt was very comfortable. It was on the clearance rack as well, but I did not like the choker part of the shirt. It laid really weirdly. Um, it was like double bunched, but then it was only one piece. I don't know. I didn't like it, um, but it was comfortable. This next shirt was, I think, $14.99 in a 2 or 3X. Um, it's very pretty. They had a bunch of different colors. It's off-the-shoulder shirt. Um, yeah, I really like this one, but I didn't purchase anything from Rainbow today. This next one was very cheaply made. Um, it was a distressed hooded shirt, but as you can see here, it's it's just falling apart, and it's, it's not part of the shirt. And it has that roll-up effect. No, 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 no. This one was another distressed version of that, and it was better made uh, material, but it just, I don't know. I didn't like it. These were on the clearance rack. I thought these were going to be really cute, but I don't know. It was that weird wishy material I don't know how to explain it it was an a3x or an 1820 um too big actually so I didn't get them they were seven dollars and yeah this next dress is really pretty but it had that um white stretch effect when you you know when it was pulled too tight it shows the white um so it was cheaply made but you know I think it was like 10 bucks this was actually really cute. You would definitely have to wear some Spanx or just wear it however. I mean, if you don't care. Um, but it did show the belly and a little bit of the outline there. Um, it is double layered. These shorts were in a 22, I believe. And they were a little bit too tight. Rainbow runs small. Um, but they were 20 bucks. Uh, this shirt was really cute. But it was $20. And that's too much for me for Rainbow. And here you go. Here's another brand that Rainbow carries, and it's the same size as the 22, and it don't even get over my thighs. That's why you got to try things on, guys. They had some cute shoes, and they were all $9, or buy one, get one for something. They were really, really cheap. They were anywhere from $9 to $12, and they were actually really cute. Um, These last ones were so pretty. They were so sparkly. <laughs> so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like, subscribe, and share. As always, appreciate it. Bye, guys. Ahem. <laughs>